Hi there. Well, it's late August and we thought we'd give you an update in terms of what's been going on here on site at the church. Uh, there's been a lot of activity in the past couple of weeks. Uh, as you can see behind me, rather than being just a big empty space now, there's lots of partition walls that are in place. There's electrical cables that are hanging from the ceilings. The toilets are being completed and there's lots of material and equipment that's now being installed into the building. Not least of which is the stud partitioning walls down here and upstairs. Now downstairs we're using a metal stud partition uh, to create the walls uh, ready for the electricians to put their cables in, to put in plug sockets and all the things that they need to put in. And upstairs you'll see we're also using wooden partitioning because we're creating yet another levels on top of our partitioning. So here we are back on the first floor and as you can see behind me there's an awful lot of wooden partitioning as I mentioned before making up the various rooms to my right. Behind me is the stage as you can see as well lots of wood beginning to form the area of the stage and to the far left of the stage is where we're going to have our baptismal tank. Just behind me the big space is the creche area where mums with their kids or dads with their kids can come and be in that room which is a soundproof room uh, and there'll be a big glass screen so that people can see actually what's going on inside a church uh, in, in the confines of, of a special area for them. And then behind there is uh, our prayer room and one of the things we wanted to make sure was that we had the opportunity for a quiet space within this building where people could come and just have space to pray. This is what will eventually become a community room. And we're going to make it so that it will be used as a community cinema for local people to come uh, and to better enjoy free movies uh, as a service to our, our local community. To my left, just behind me, you may be able to see the staircase which leads up to the first floor. And directly behind me is where the plant room is for all the electricity cabling and um, junction boxes and goodness knows what else is in there to feed the whole building. To my right is where the kitchen will be and there will be a serving hatch which will come directly into this particular part of the building. But it's also been a very exciting time because very recently we held a summer ball to try and raise money for our disabled access lift which is just over to my right or will be. I'm really pleased to be able to tell you that as a result of the fundraising from that night and everybody's generosity uh, and in addition to the money that was raised on the night which was just under £8,000, we also managed to sell um, the VW Beetle that you may recall we were given earlier in the year which raised a further £2,500 which means that we have over £10,000 to go towards that particular part of the project, which we're very excited about. So as you can see, we're moving forward and uh, step by step, we're getting there. Um, and in the coming weeks, more contractors will be on site installing their first fixes for things like the, uh, the heating system and also for things like the very important AV uh, system, which are gonna be going into the building to make it a church that we can use here on Sundays and throughout the week. So that's where we are. It's all very exciting. Hope you're encouraged by what you see. Uh, we have to keep praying that God will provide because once again, very soon we'll get to the point where we'll buy. we have no money left, but every time we've been in that position, God has provided more. So we're expecting God to continue to provide as we need it. We've still got some way to go, but we're trusting that God is going to enable us to enjoy the blessing of this building and for it to be a blessing to this community in the very near future. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. God bless.